Hey everybody, Kevin here with Pursuing Pixels, and this is episode number 158 of 15 Minutes of Game, and as you can see, I'm going to be playing some Drac Unite here, and this is another game from uh, Sunshine Man or Securus. I've seen both names on their uh, profile page or whatever on Itch.io, but uh, this was part of the uh, low-res game jam, and I've been a huge fan of the three games I've done from them uh, previously, uh, Bunny Eats, Sealed Bite, and I think White Hearts was the name of the other one. I might, I might be drawing a blank on that, but I played a little bit of this one and was loving the kind of puzzle platformy mini, uh, very emphasis on the mini Metroidvania mechanics, but like just enjoying the combat uh, and the just low res style. Um, doesn't seem like you have to kill every enemy or anything like that, but even like the fact that a bat doesn't take just one hit. Um, and yeah, you can see I got three hearts right now, and you have your slash kind of combo attack, which I just love that series of attacks, and then you have this throwing axe, which by the way is your weapon, so right now I'm not able to attack until I retrieve it, uh, but you obviously have to use that for a little bit of puzzle platforming as well, and one of the things I love too is that axe will just like travel screen to screen, so like even though it is a screen by screen game, like, I'll have to call it back to me all the way from where it went. So it, it can go all the way to the end of the level, essentially, which is kind of nuts. And you can see your UI up at the top of the screen uh, if you have your axe. And then, again, if you've, like, collected a key, which obviously I don't have right now, but it just disappeared a second ago. But, yeah, I just played, like, the first couple of, like, chunks of this game and was immediately loving it. And was like, okay, I know I'm a fan of all their previous games, so I might as well add this to the collection here. Um... And yeah, just fair warning on the spoiler alert, I don't know how far I'm going to get on this playthrough, but uh, I, I'm hoping to uh, maybe play through the whole thing. I know this was done in a game jam, so in a short amount of time, so... Uh, but yeah, I got myself a key, and you're just kind of progressing through. Like, eventually it's not so linear. It seemed like the last, like, chunk I did, which was, I think, this set of rooms or maybe the next. Um, but it was a little less, like, obvious what I needed to do. Um... And I had to do a little bit of backtracking and stuff. So that's sort of what I mean by mini Metroidvania. But me personally, I love when they're more split up in like a little mini series of challenges as opposed to like, oh, unlock a bunch of different abilities and yada, yada, yada. Just gets to be a little bit too much for me personally. But even, yeah, just the uh, puzzle platforming with like throwing your axe around and like trying to figure out how to get through these segments is really, really cool. Um... And it's a really, you know, for being such a limited, uh, obviously low-res style, like, it's really got a, a really expressive, like, animation style, even though you like your character, and like, I don't know, I, I really like how blocky and everything looks, uh, but it, at the same time how, like, I don't know, everything feels nice and juicy. Uh, but I can even fill up a couple more hearts here eventually, so... All right, let's keep moving along. Yeah, I, uh, I think I got just to this room and then was like, yep, another winner from Sunshine Man. So we'll see how far, oh yeah, getting some poison into the mix. I love this art style. I don't know what it is about it, but again, you gotta be careful with like, so one of the things is like, so I'm throwing my ax for this little bit of puzzle platforming going on. Uh, and But once I throw the ax, I'm not able to attack, but I can also press the throw button and call it back to me. So, like, I don't know. There's there's a good amount of, like, and I love how, like, it's not just... I might have said this already, but I love how, like, the single screens are not, like, a limitation of any kind. Like, the map seems to... Like, the whole entire uh, game world seems to be at play, in play at all times, which is really cool. Oh, yeah, that's how you fucking do it. That was, that was sweet. This is a really cool game, and I really like this music, too. I'll just uh, avoid that, maybe. So, oh, maybe I'm gonna have to kill them both. Oh, no! Okay, it just resets the room. I was like, what, what happens? Oh, I guess I could probably throw my axe. I still took some damage there. I wonder what I did. Ah, shit. Come on. This is getting tricky. Get out of here. Okay, this is not getting no joke. They're breaking the action out now. Okay, I think I got a plan. Even though I don't need to kill this thing, I'm going to. I think I can do it from here, even though it's off screen. Let's see. Nope. 
Maybe I can't do damage, because I've definitely opened chests before like that. Oh, and they're like, yeah, they're clearly poisonous, so I got, okay, it definitely has to be a throw attack. Or I, I don't know if it's poisonous, but they're doing damage to, oh shit. God damn it! Maybe it's just better to just avoid him. Because this first one, okay, this first one's no biggie to avoid. I take four hits, three hits? Got five hits when it comes to throws, at least. Okay, I'm gonna run here. Oh, yeah. Give me that key. No. Okay. So I'm not gonna be able to throw that like I hoped. Take a couple cheap shots with this uppercut. There we go. So yeah, maybe they're not poisonous. I must have just taken like a cheap shot from uh, one of its projectiles, like right as it got fired. Because you can seemingly touch those things without taking damage. I love this tune too. It's like keeping the uh, keeping the momentum going. Oh shit! It's not gonna be a good way to attack that thing. Get me out of here. Yes. Good thing I already got the key. Oh, man. They're still trying to attack me from the side. That's fucked up. I don't know if I can make that. Fuck. Instant kill in the poison, too. Okay. Not going that way. Oh, not going that way. Oh, wait a minute. No. Don't tell me this game is freaking amazing. If I have to go around, oh yeah, <laughs> oh yeah. So like, not only is that like you have to take advantage of the the screens moving and whatnot, and leaving your axe behind and leaving your oh, give me a heart, yes. Oh, that was so satisfying. Shit. Oh, weird. Went right through that thing? I, okay, that's gonna be where the key's at. Yes! I was just gonna say, I don't know where that key could be. Sit your ass down, Skelly Boy. And a heart on top of it. Oh, wrong way. I always think I'm gonna know the direction. go. Wonder, I'm not going to chance it, but I wonder what happens if you don't go through the door. Oh, this could be the final boss here. It's got a huge fucking health bar. But fair warning, like I said on the spoilers, if this is the final boss. Oh, you got nothing on me. If it is, these last few videos are going to be on the... Oh, short side, I only got one hit left. Fuck! Come on. But I love these little game jam games so much. I mean, I know there's there's so many different styles and types of games, so it's, that's such a blanket statement. But like, it's it's just amazing. And I've said this in many of the videos that have been from games from game jams. But like people can do over the course of like a week or two days or a weekend or whatever is just absolutely mind-blowing. Sit down. Oh. Is that just a mini-boss? Beat the game? No. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, heck yeah. This game is opening up. Uh, I, went, I was thinking I maybe had to do, like, some kind of chain jump with the axe. Oh, this is cool as hell. I gotta collect all those. I don't know how to get that, though. Oh, I gotta shatter that. Okay. Oh, heck yeah. Sorry if these sound effects are kind of loud. They're definitely loud on my end. I don't think I need to kill all of these things. I think I just need to... 
Oh yeah, give me full hearts. I think I just need to destroy these shards. Oh yeah. Get out of here. Are they just following my movements? I don't think so. They kind of look like dark versions of me, though. Like zombies. Oh, shit. This is getting real. No. I got full health, though. I'm super worried. Oh, shit. Yeah, because that's definitely draining that health bar at the bottom as I uh, break the shards. Okay. Thankfully, these things are coughing up hearts, too, like crazy. Oh, how many more? There's, uh, there's a decent amount more here. Let's go. Now, there's got to be more than that. Because that's just... I think that's just going to drop me back down. Nope. Nope. No! Ah, you sucker. Ah, all right. At least I kind of know what I'm doing now. I want to get back up to five hearts, though, as soon as I can. There we go. There we go. You got nothing on me. Oh, yeah. Speed run time. Oh, no. Like, I feel like that's such a long stretch without any of those gems dropping up. No. I was gonna say, it's pretty easy to dodge taking damage. Not if you let them keep piling up like that. Like, the health bar is about halfway... I didn't get too much further than this. A little more than halfway. But I think I broke, like, with this gem. This is about as far as I got, I think. Yeah, this one here. But this just is just gonna drop me down. Oh, no! Okay. Should've just kept going. Should've listened to my gut. I thought it was just gonna drop me down to the start. Couple more. Give me the hearts. A little generous on the hearts, but I'm not complaining. One more. Last one. Dracky Knight, you're going down, baby! Ho 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 ho! Heck yeah. Or Dracula, I should say. But yeah, this game was super fun. Uh, highly recommend checking out the rest of the stuff from Secure Us, aka Sunshine Man. Um, and here's the rest of the credits. I'll let those roll out as the video closes out. But uh, thanks for watching, and uh, definitely check out the game. I'll have links in the video description, as always. And until the next one, take care, and uh, catch you next time. Thanks.